previously on Relapse Productions. So I'm here at my editing PC. Um, I'm just uh, working on the latest episode for uh, the channel. And uh, basically the whole PC just shut down. This is the, the PC booting up. Okay, here's the issue here. Your PC ran into a problem and needs to restart. Will restart for you. Automatic repair couldn't repair your PC. I don't really know what to do. I don't really know my options here. Don't really feel like I have too many options to be honest with you. Um, also, I don't really have too much money. I just paid my rent. Um, I bought a bunch of groceries, you know, just the normal things that you have to do to survive. I was in the process of working on uh, uh, the current episode and hopefully was going to put it out by Sunday. So I'm just going to unhook everything and uh, take it to the repair shop. Uh, yeah, I know it. Um, it turns on, but every time you, you turn it on, it says that it needs to repair itself, and then it tries to repair itself. System, right? Okay. And then it, and then it says that it can't repair itself, and then it just says uh, that it needs to turn off. Okay. okay. And now the conclusion. I just ate at King Taco. I had a, a carne asada burrito and uh, some sopas. But uh, this whole issue with the computer kind of has me a little stressed out. And um, I came out here to Huntington Beach just to, uh, I don't know, sort some things out of my mind about what am I gonna do about the computer? Or, Cause it's kind of like, kind of has me frustrated. Good old Huntington Beach Pier. Uh, the waves look like they're pretty big right now. It, you can see how hard they're hitting into the, uh, the, the legs that hold the pier up. Wow. Yeah, this whole issue with the computer though, it has me like really stressed out because for one, I don't have enough money to really do anything with it. I dropped it off today. The repair guy says he's gonna call me tomorrow. Uh, m all I'm hoping for is it just not to be uh, anything very bad, that it's like, gonna cost me an arm and leg to repair because if I was to repair it and it cost me an arm and a leg, I might as well save that money and just get a brand new computer. Another another issue that I'm running into though is that that computer has a lot of files for uh, the YouTube channel. So I'm trying to hold on to that PC so I don't lose all that, that information. But yeah, it's just, just really has me, I hate really, I, I can't stand really going over something like this in my mind like so much this thing is this is one of those issues that that uh could get my anxiety all rattled and before you know it i end up in the freaking hospital feeling like i'm gonna have a heart attack so, i don't know i'm just gonna hope for the best that's all i really can do I hope for the best uh, Another option I have is just, just just repair this computer and just start saving up some money to purchase a new one. That's another option I'm thinking about.
Hi you. <laughs> Hi. Yo, I'm glad that I came out here to get myself in a more positive mindset because all this thinking had my 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 brain just so racked up. But it felt like my brain was like literally in a hamster ball, just spinning, thinking about everything that was going on. And mentally, I'm tired from thinking about all this stuff. Physically, I'm tired because just walked around the beach, checked out the uh, the pier and these huge waves that we have right now. Uh, but um, I'm doing everything that I can possibly for myself. Uh, all I can do is just put the computer in the repair shop and give it to the computer techs and let them do what they gotta do. The moral of the story is us as people, we're always worried about our problems that we're facing or we're, th we're overthinking things. Um, we need to focus on the things that we can control. It's about that time. Your boy's gonna get out of here. I'ma do what it do and I see you when I see you.